I am out and about running errands today. It is a Saturday and it's probably a really bad idea, idea that I'm going to Target because it's going to be crazy busy. But I just need to go in and out. Just I need a few things like Q-tips. <laughs> so um I it's so cold out today, you guys. Like it's it's warm. It's 30 degrees in Minnesota that's warm for us um, it's 30 degrees but the wind chill is so stinking cold <laughs> like it just hits you and it just takes your breath away it's so cold so I decided I needed something hot while I was out and about so I got me some caribou this is not a paid plug for caribou coffee <laughs> but I love caribou like for those of you that don't know what caribou is, I am so sorry. <laughs> I it's it's a Minnesota thing. I per, yeah. It originated in Minnesota and now it's kind of branching out to the some of the northwestern states, I think, northeast too. Um but caribou is where it's at, guys. I'm so sorry that you're missing out. <laughs> but um, Starbucks just does not cut it. Starbucks, I like their black coffee. They make good black coffee. But they're like mixed drinks and chais and stuff. Like this is a this is a chai with made with almond milk. But it's like uh, no, not not even comparable. Like bleh, 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 bleh. Like Starbucks' stuff is so sweet, like too sweet, and it's fake. They don't use real chocolate, I don't think. And Caribou, they put like huge chunks of dark chocolate when they're making their mochas. That's why I always get like a dark mocha at Caribou whenever I want to treat myself. Because it's made with real dark chocolate, and I can guarantee that there is no dairy in that. And Starbucks uses like the pumps, just like everybody else. So Caribou is where it's at. Shout out, caribou, whoop whoop. Um, but I'm about to tackle Target. Hopefully I can go in and out. I know that the register lines can be long, but you know what? Just gotta have a little patience, <laughs> get through it. But I've got a big afternoon ahead of me. Every state, pretty much every state has a Super Saturday, what we call Super Saturday, but um, so Super Saturday is, is basically a bunch of beach body coaches getting together. A really inspirational um, couple of hours where we're just listening to some amazing people talk um, about their journeys, about their health, and, and just um, just inspiring us to go out and help more people. And um, and then we always finished with a big group workout. And this one is a pretty big deal because Sagi Kalev himself is in Minnesota and he's going to be at this event. We got him to come! Woo woo! So Sagi Kalev is the beast. He's body beast. If you've heard of Beachbody's body beast, um, he is a beast. Um, and he's also the hammer of hammer and chisel so he's he's a pretty amazing amazing guy and um he's he's got a lot of love he's got a lot of love a lot of faith and in a lot of amazing experiences and and stuff to say like he's he's very intimidating but he's just got so much love and last night at the meet and greet i got to tell him my story briefly um I got to tell him about, you know, how hammer and chisel helped me with my lymphedema. You know, I could lift it this far and now I can lift it all the way up and do whatever the heck I want with it. And it was it was a struggle to push through, but the workouts that he did, that he made, got me through that and um and he had a lot of, a lot of amazing things to tell me and, and to inspire me to keep on going and keep on pushing and so I told him thank you, thank you. But um yeah, he's he's a great guy, and I'm excited to to hear from him today. Hear what he has to say to all of us. And a thousand people is a big deal, Minnesota, <laughs> the Twin Cities. Yeah, that's what I'm doing today. So I'll bring you guys along. I don't know how much footage I'll get, but I'll bring you guys along. But now I'm gonna do Target, and I'm gonna drink more of this amazing, delicious chai. Done. My story with you. And hopefully you can take something from it and uh, 
speak to you guys and see where I'm, why I'm standing here and why I can tell you that when you ask me how I'm doing, I will say to you, I am blessed. That's how I feel. What an amazing day. It was such a good day. I, it's, it's now 9.30 and I'm just getting home <laughs> from the Super Saturday event and it was so cool. Um, got there around 12.30 today and I got in line for, um, to, to do a photo op with Siggy to get my picture taken with Siggy, a professional one. Of course, I came up to him today and I said hello again and, and he's like, oh, how did you sleep? How was your sleep? Did you sleep well last night? <laughs> he's just such a big, loving, caring man and so he asked me how my sleep was and I said it was okay <laughs> and he's like, how are you today? Are you okay today? <laughs> are you going to work out today? And I'm like, yes, I am. And, um, so he totally remembered me. He totally remembered my story and he he took a few pictures with me and then, you know, it was kind of like a, we were trying to get through the line, you know, really, really fast because it was a long lane line and so it's basically like one snap per person, move on to the next person, just kind of like shuffle through the people really fast. But he, he stopped me as I was like walking away. He was like, no, 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 more, <laughs> take more. And so he gave me a big hug and his cheek was right here and he gave me a big hug and we took some more pictures. So I'm really excited to see those. And he's just the sweetest man, just has this big heart. He's awesome he's got an amazing amazing story and so he he talked a little bit about his story and where he came from you know he he grew up in Israel and um, you know had a really hard upbringing you know and then he decided that he was going to move to the United States and he lived in a car for a long time and but he he was determined that he was going to make it and he was going to be you know one of the best at at bodybuilding and all these um competitions you know and 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 he actually mentioned that um he's been on more magazine covers than Arnold Schwarzenegger <laughs> I never knew that about him but kind of cool so um so yeah, it was just, it was amazing. And all of the speakers, his wife talked, she's a coach, she's like a top coach. And she talked and it, it was such a good day. And we had a big team of us. I brought one of my new coaches with and, and it was good to get to know her and meet her and just, you know, we all worked out and oh my gosh. The coolest thing happened, um, my coach, um, her husband, John, he's gone through P90X3, he's done Beast, uh, Body Beast, and he, he is a beast. <laughs> he actually was going through the photo op and got his picture taken with Sugi, and Sugi actually asked him if he would um, do the workout on stage with him. He only asked two people, one girl, one guy, and John was that guy. So I got a little footage in <laughs> of it. It was pretty cool. John looked so happy and he, super proud of him. How awesome is that, that he got to do that? Like, I know that he's got to feel really accomplished um, getting to do that. And what an amazing experience for him. So, And then after the event, um, like seven of us coaches on our team we all went out to Applebee's <laughs> and had dinner and we just talked forever and I'm just getting home <laughs> like the event was done at like 5 30 maybe and we went to eat right after that when we're back at 9 30 I just I love being part of this I love my team I love what I do I just get to experience these amazing things and be with these amazing people all the time this is my job <laughs> and I enjoy it so much and um, so that's all there is to it so uh, that's my day I'm super tired I'm gonna wash up my face and put my PJs on and go to 
bed. So if you guys like this video, give it a big fat thumbs up and <laughs> be sure to subscribe and I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Tomorrow is Tea Time Tuesday and I'm gonna be talking about um, a really cool thing that somebody sent me and I'm gonna do a little review on it and um, yeah, it's pretty, pretty, pretty cool story on that. So I'm gonna share that with you guys tomorrow and I'll see you for that. Have a good night, day, morning, whatever time it is for you. <laughs> I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Hey friends, thanks for watching the video today and I need your help because I'm doing a little challenge this month. The month of April, I am doing a video every single day. I've not done this before, so it's a new thing for me. It's definitely a challenge, but I'm taking it on. But I need your help. I need you to leave me a comment. Tell me what kind of video you want me to do. Maybe a challenge. Maybe you want me to share a day in the life or what I eat in the day. Just give me a comment. Tell me what you want to see. Make sure to subscribe before you leave. And I'll see you guys in the next one tomorrow. Bye!